R2P wants to achieve that public transport becomes accessible, it becomes fun, and it becomes a safe environment to go from A to B. And feeling safe is not just for your personal welfare, but also feeling safe. Is it on time? Can I get the information that I need? Is it actually bringing me to where I have to be? The solution portfolio is passenger announcement system for bus and train. It's passenger information system for bus and train. It's passenger counting system for bus and trains. Uh, it's CCTV solutions for, uh, for buses and trains. Uh, and then we have a vertical that is within telemetry uh, system also for buses and, and other areas where basically you have all the telemetry values from cars, but also the tracking uh, part of it, geofencing, etc. So this is the portfolio. customers that we have are in most countries, so more or less regardless in which region or which country that they move into, R2P as a global player, we are able to move around together with our clients in exactly those areas with support within the right time zones, meeting exactly the on-site support requirements, uh, legal requirements. That's definitely a value to our customers that, that they know if they contract up with us for a specific country in a specific uh, area where we're already active, we know what we're up against and what we have to fulfill in that, uh, in that specific area. It's just a matter of the time before our fossil uh, resources are used up. So, so we have to do something and we have to do it now. I'm convinced that we can make a difference. And that's one of the reasons why we get out of the bed in the morning is that we are convinced and dedicated to make this difference. We were one of the early adapters also, just with our components looking into power consumption, looking into weights, looking into small, small, small factors that actually plays a role. If you have to move a, an object from A to B, the weight is of essence. Another thing is, is power consumption as well. The less power your components consume, the less power you have to bring onto the vehicles, the smaller batteries you need if it's a battery charged vehicle that you're on. It has to be fun, it has to be interesting, and it has to be easy to go on public transport.